All right, guys, so I'm uh, going to show you how I wired up my uh, Castle Beck 2.0 waterproof. I've seen a couple uh, comments online uh, about this application, specifically for the TRX4. Uh, there's some uh, different wiring setup. So the, the 2.0 has two wire leads, uh, one that just has your, uh, your black and red power, and then another one that has your, your brown negative red positive and then a signal wire so the instructions do say that both need to be hooked up however in the uh, factory Traxxas uh, TQI system there's only one free port which is on the 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 second channel one uh, port back here so you don't actually have two ports to plug this into I believe that the only real purpose for this uh, three pole is so you can hook it into your castle back and program it uh, but but I'm not certain so so what I decided to do was to take the uh, two power or two wire connector put it into that second channel one slot uh, and then I'm running a uh, ESS sound module on mine so I already have a Y splitter on my uh, channel two so what I did is I took the prong out of uh, that clip and everything seems to work so if I if I do grab a battery and, and the wiring is messy I'll, I'll clean that up here in a minute but if I turn this on uh, you'll see that the receivers on turn the remote on receivers turned yellow so I have I have my steering but there's there's no throttle my sound module works but I'm not moving. So then if I go over here and turn the receiver on or the speed control on, you'll see that that works also. So I got some cleaning up to do on the wiring, but I believe this will work. Um, right now I'm running this at six volts only, uh, but I have an upgraded servo on the way that's running on seven four. So I will probably do a uh, Holmes Hobby biplat pass splitter on just this this uh, two pole power connector off the back. Uh, so I will take uh, this wire right here, plug one end into the bypass, the other one into channel one, and then the power wire or the signal wire coming from the servo will go into the other end of that bypass, and hopefully uh, I can get the 7.4 volts. Um, that I paid for, it looks to me like the the gauge of these wires is both equal. So I'm hoping uh, just that one being connected will be enough uh, to to feed the you know six amps and, and 7.4 volts that I'll need to power the big servo. But I'll keep you posted on that. Uh, hopefully this helps to ask a couple of questions. Uh, it is very confusing because, like I said, uh, normal Becks don't have. Uh, two two different input wires, so that, that makes it a little little complicated. It's fine if you have a you know a big five or six channel receiver and you're only running a servo and a speed control. But uh, for the TRX4 that comes with the the dual speed transmission and the two diff lock servos, there's just no room in that receiver to plug both of them in. So that's all I got.